This tutorial is to show you how to take multiple artboards and export them to have different files um, so that you don't have to kind of cut and paste into a lot of different documents. So you'll see for this uh, project, I'm making tickets for the upcoming sporting events. And I've got them laid out kind of blank so that the um, athletics department can add the details as they have each event. And so I've got my files set up on multiple artboards. So if I go to my artboards, you'll see I have 12 artboards right now. And just as a, um, a kind of a note, there's a great way here to rearrange your artboards. You can change how many columns, how the kind of the order they go in and so on and so forth. So if you ever need to do that, you can do that there. Um, and so what I'm gonna do is right now, this is just saved as an AI file. I'm gonna go to file, export as, I'm gonna choose PNG, and for this, um, I'm gonna pick a specific place for them to go. So I'm gonna, I'm in like my work folders, I'm gonna create a new folder that says tickets 2021, hit create. So it's gonna go into this folder. I've got PNG selected as my export, and you can do this with JPEGs and PDFs and other things too. Um, I don't know if you can do it with PDF, but you can do it with uh, some other file types, but I usually use PNGs. And then I'm gonna click this button right here that says use artboards. If you don't see this information when you're working, you probably just don't have all your options showing, um, although it looks like it's there too. So if you ever wanna see more stuff, just click that little carrot. PNG, and then I'm gonna click use artboards. And for this point, I'm gonna do all of them. So I can just make sure all is selected. I'm gonna hit export. I'm gonna make sure my resolution is set to high. For this, I'm gonna keep the white uh, background, but if you wanted a transparent background or a black one, you can change that there and then hit okay. And then in my work folders, you'll see, there's a lot of stuff in here. There's my tickets 2021. If I double click, here's all those files separately. So you'll see when it exports it, it takes my file name and then it just adds dash 01, dash 02, dash 03 for the different artboards but now I have just that file as its own artboard. Let's say I was working on something, I fixed up this one, I changed the colors on artboard eight, and I just want that one, or maybe I did eight and nine. When I go back to that export, I don't need all the other ones. I can do use artboards range and change that eight to nine, or whatever ones you need, and then export it, and it will just do those ones. I hope that's helpful.